Hi everybody, I hope you are doing well and not finding this isolation too hard. Um, and today's promise is really relevant to that and the first half is especially relevant to us too at the moment. So it's Hebrews 13 verse 5 and it says keep your lives free from the love of money and be content with what you have which I think we're all having to do a lot right now aren't we? Um, some more than others and I think actually I feel very grateful and praise God for how much I have every time I open the fridge and there's some food in there um, isn't that a wonderful wonderful thing to praise God for and so yeah so be content with what you have but then the promise part of the verse says because God has said never will I leave you never will I forsake you and I love it you might have heard in a preach before that I've said but I love it when in the amp version the amplified version it says never ever I will never ever ever leave you I will never 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 abandon you no way no way sort of thing it really just like emphasizes it and I just think that's amazing that that's God's promise to us so no matter how separated we might feel from our loved ones from our family from our friends at the moment we have that promise that God never ever leaves us and never ever abandons us and in our lives we may have had people in the past who have deliberately rejected us and deliberately abandoned us and God will never ever do that to us and what an amazing promise that is we can build our lives on a firm foundation that we will never be alone and I think that's an incredible thing and I think sometimes it's easy particularly if like me you live on your own so you're in isolation at the moment on your own to feel lonely at times and that's okay that's okay you're not being a bad Christian just because you're feeling lonely um, I just think it's more and more important that we hang on to these words that he's always with us and I just love his presence so I really just maybe I can pray for you today so and father I just thank you so much for this opportunity to sit out here in the sunshine and I just ask that each person who is hearing this, whether they are living on their own or with family, if they're feeling lonely, Lord, would they know the reality of your presence today by your Holy Spirit? Would they know the reality of that promise that you will never, ever leave them and never, ever forsake them? Amen. See you guys tomorrow, I hope.